What is up everyone? It is Water and Grass here and I will be uploading this video to the Planet Pokey Network page. Now I am brand new to this whole Planet Pokey thing. I am not brand new to Poketubing. In fact, I'm pretty old when it comes to Poketubing. I've been doing this for a long time. You can ask my buddy Slayer of MCA. Uh, so I decided to get involved with the network. I applied, they accepted me, and uh, yeah, I'm happy to be a part of it and hopefully it'll be a lot of fun. Now in this video, which hopefully you guys like, if you're feeling a little bit nostalgic, if you're into old school type things, you're definitely going to like this video. So I got uh, these envelopes that I opened up. I got them all from eBay. Very, 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 very cheap too. Um, I took them out of the envelope, you know, so we could save time so we don't have to sit here and uh, blibber blabber forever. I don't know if blibber blabber is a word, but I just made it up. Anyway, <laughs> so without further ado, let us get started on what we got here. Let me start things off by showing you that we got two jungle packs right here. These are very, very cool, and these are some of the oldest cards, oldest Pokemon cards. We got a Wigglytuff and a Flareon right there. The reason why this one's on cardboard is because, well, you'll see why in a second. We'll put them in front of Poliwhirl. Covering up Poliwhirl. I'm sorry, Poliwhirl. We'll move Torterra out of the way. And uh, show this last. Now let's show you some of these packs. These are kind of loose. So we got a Charizard pack art. Also back on that cardboard. I couldn't imagine why it would be on that cardboard though. I mean, I just I just don't know guys. Why, why would it be on that cardboard? <laughs> Cover up Torterra. And then we have one of each pack art as loose packs. We got Charizard, Blastoise, and Venusaur. These are the original sets and I just feel so happy holding these. I haven't even seen these in like, geez, uh, <laughs> 12, 13 years now, whenever they came out. I'm thinking 99 they came out or something like that. 98 maybe. I don't remember. It was a long time ago and I have not held them or seen them in a while. So that's good to have. So we'll put these right here if we can get them to stand. Oh no. Oh no. Everything's falling apart. Okay, there we go. Let's get Flareon to stand up. Thank you, Flareon. Now these are really, really cool. This is what I really want to show you guys. Uh, I'll show you these three first. Actually, let me show you this one first. There we go. Boom. This is actually what they sold back in the day when I was a kid. These three little pack blisters. I remember seeing these at Target, uh, Kmart, Walmart, everywhere they had these. You can see that's where they retail. This is sealed. There is a gym challenge pack with the Blaine pack art right there. Very, very cool. There's also a jungle pack with Wigglytuff. And then back there, we have a legendary collection pack with uh, Moltres, Articuno, and Zapdos on it. So this is very, 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 very awesome. As you can see, it was $3.99. And then it was on clearance. So I don't know how much that says on clearance, but I'm sure it says 88 cents. So this was 88 cents back in the day, guys. You got a pack of jungle, a pack of gym challenge, and a pack of legendary collection for 88 cents. Not bad, not bad, right? We'll put him back there. And then these, they also had two pack blisters. And the most common two pack, bleh, two pack blisters they had back in the day what are these? Jungle and base set. So I got uh, two Blastoise. There's a Flareon and Blastoise right there. Very, very cool. And then right here, and as you can see, I'm not lying, this one is, this one was 60 cents. I don't, you won't be able to see it right there, but I promise you that's what it says. So these were really, really cheap back in the day compared to what they cost now. So we got one with Blastoise and Flareon, and one with Blastoise and Wigglytuff, and yes, these are sealed. Very, 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 very awesome to have. Put them in front of Palkia, since this is like kind of like an old school bonanza. And Palkia is not very old school, but <laughs> and then this one is probably my favorite blister because it has two of my favorite Pokemon on there. We got a Scyther pack art for Jungle, and as well as this Venusaur pack art right here. So in total, that's one, two, three, four, five. We got seven base set packs as well as six jungle and then a gym challenge and a legendary collection i don't think i'm going to be opening these blisters these sealed blisters however that doesn't mean i won't open maybe these three right here because i do really really want to open some uh base set packs so maybe if i uh, get enough views on my channel enough subscribers i'm think i'm aiming for around 5000 maybe 5500 i'm at like 4100 right now but i mean the only reason why i'm aiming so high is because i mean these are just so old and so nostalgic that you know i want to make sure i'm at a good number before i start opening these but we got three packs right here 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So we went down a, uh, a trip down memory lane, a nostalgic trip. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this little nostalgic little thingy. And uh, yeah, check out my channel for a ton of openings. I got a ton of openings, TCBMs. I'll have an updated trade binder, uh, all that good stuff. Definitely, definitely, definitely check it out. Uh, I've been doing this for a while, so I know what I'm doing. Uh, thank you so much for Planet Pokey for letting me open this. I'm excited to be a full screen partner as well as a Planet Pokey partner. And yeah, I'll see you all in the next video or on my channel. Whatever you guys decide to look at first. Alright guys, bye bye.